Ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready to rumble! Hello guys and welcome back to Sinbin Breaks and today we've got the new 2223 Series 2 Hockey. Obviously everybody's chasing young guns, that's what Series 1 and 2 are known for. In this particular product it's Slavkovsky, Johnson, Sanderson, Gooley, Wright, those are kind of the big chasers. There's other some other rookies in there as well or some other young guns. Um, this year actually includes some really neat new things, the Lunchbox Legends, um, the highlighters, which I personally like, I think those are really neat cards. Um, the one I'm not really, I think it's just kind of a meh card is the World Juniors grads. But for the most part, um, everything I've seen has really been, really been nice in this product. So uh, we're going to go ahead and just jump right in. Probably blow through the base since most everybody has seen them uh, by now was able to get this box for 115 shipped us um yeah my card guy had them actually on the shelf for 125 but because of my charming personality i got him down to 115 I, actually it's not true i just asked and he did so um but anyway so let's get right into this and we're just going to start right here at the front um, haven't really seen where a lot of the hits are, so maybe we can make this kind of extend out a little bit. So just get to the hits right here. Hey, French oh, right. young gun. You gotta love Abir. God, I can't think. I can't remember how to say his name. It, Jake, Jake, I think. All right, not terrible. It would have been nice if that had been Slikovsky, but hey, you know, it is what it is. It's a French young gun, and yeah. So, okay, we'll just put that little guy right back there. Not bad for a first pack. Let's go with pack number two. Try to make this a relatively quick rip. So, Nyquist and Declan Chisholm. I think he's one of the other decent young guns going after well, I hope they're not all in this front stack, or the rest of the box is going to be kind of blah. <laughs> but I think we're we just kind of got lucky with the with a couple of packs. I think some of the packs shifted in here. So, all right, let's just keep on rolling. Boy, wouldn't it be nice to get a hot box? We had we've seen some of those over from series one and two from this year and last year. So there's Suzuki, McAvoy, McCabe. Grandland and UD Canvas of Darnell Nurse. And of course, the Canvas cards always look so nice. But yeah, we've seen there's there were some boxes last year that had some, or Series 1, I guess I should say, that had some serious stuff. Ooh, I think we got a highlighter. Tang, Lewis. Yeah, we do. That's your Demco. <laughs> That's cool. Nice. I really like these. I think some of them are numbered, so this is just the base, I believe. But we'll go ahead and sleeve him up. I don't remember if these are case hits. Um, I'm trying to remember how many. Let's just look at the back on this one. Highlighters are. Yellow is one of 192. Orange is one of 156. Huh. I don't see anything on here about blue. Oh, well. Hey, we'll take it. We'll take it. So that must be our acetate hit. Rust, Nuge. Baron Kako and Instant Impressions Andrei Svechnikov. 
these aren't terrible inserts. Um, kind of makes them like an old schooling, some of these little Polaroid look to them, but they're not, it's not terrible. Definitely not terrible. Last pack on the front right. Mercer, Ben, Hannafin, and a young gun of Casey Fitzgerald. Well, hello there. I think he was another one that wasn't, not like a prominent one, but I think he was another one that was kind of a chase in this. So, well, that's three young guns in one stack. Um, don't know what that's going to hold for the rest of the box, but it's at least a couple of decent ones. So let's just do front left now. Oh, crap. <laughs> Sorry. I'll just do, hey, Ben Myers, UD Portrait. So nice little PC hit there. Pack just, those cards just jumped out of the pack. I wasn't ready for them. All right, so Lee, Bouchard, Lickinen, Paul, honor roll of Alex, Alex Vlasic. Still have yet to hit a numbered one of these. I don't know what the deal is, but we just are, cannot hit a numbered honor roll. It's weird. Weird, weird, weird. I did hit a Camel Car Lunchbox Legends in a break, so pretty happy about that. I like those cards. Pavelski, Dow, Peronovich, and Philadelphia. Welcome to Philadelphia. These are kind of nice cards. It'd be interesting if they did like gold versions of these because I think it'd really stand out. Um, some of the backgrounds in particular would really pop if there was like gold all, gold versions. But All right, so we got two packs left on the front left. Tarasenko, Felino, Reimer, Wa, and Josh Anderson, Beauty Canvas. I think this is a short print. I think the I think this is the uh, suit variation. So I'm gonna go ahead and sleeve him up. But I think I think I remember seeing that. You can get like black and white versions as well. So all right. So last pack on the left. Front left. Front left. Is there anybody else hiding in the front? Flurry, Bennett. Cernak and Philip Crawl. I don't know what much about him. What the hell was that? For the Leafs. That could be why. <laughs> so far, that's four. I don't know if the French young gun counts as a young gun or not. I can never remember. But so far, that would be four young guns, including the French. All right. So let's just take these guys out of the box. That way we can look at our nice Nate Mac P BGS 9.5 sitting back there. Uh, Byram, Lou, Dubois, Watson, Thomas, and Dylan Holloway, UD Portraits, rookies. Not too bad. I think I definitely think this is the best version of portraits that uh, that they've done. I really it's probably my favorite design. All right, so it's Gringenson, Jones, Miller, Lucas Reichel, Dazzlers, Blue. Not bad, not bad. I think you get one blue, but if you, you're the pink is a shorter printed that you get. Um, uh, uh, pretty much a little over three quarters through. So Fabry, Perry, Raquel, Orlov, Holloway for Calder, oh, like a little much. presidential type uh, card there. So, Dylan Holloway for the Oilers. Keep on rolling here. So, I think we'll still do at least two more young guns. Bokefist, 
Larson. There's our next young gun. Hammock. Ronnie Atard. What? I bet he got lots of... <laughs> I bet he got lots of ribbon in school with that last name. Not the best one. Unfortunately, I feel like the uh, Aubert is going to be our best young gun of the box. Would have been nice to hit a clear cut young gun. That would have been pretty sweet, but tis what it is. There's Cedar, Kaliev, Dobson, Sagan, Marner, UD Canvas. Kind of interesting looking picture there, but Marner nonetheless. All right, this will be the last pack on the right-hand side, and then we got the stack on the left, and we are done. Teravinen, Pitlick, Carrick, Lunchbox Legends of Brady Kachuk. I really like this. I, the, this is probably one of my favorite inserts that they've done. I really like these cards. They're really neat. I can't wait to get that Makar in. Might just go ahead and send that off for grading just because. I know it's a cheap insert, but I think it looks really cool on a slab, to be honest. All right, first pack on the back left Zadina, Carlson, Kane, and Young Guns of Cole Kopke. What are you talking about, Willis? Got him! Don't know much about him. Maybe I'll have to reach out to one of my Lightning fans and see what his. Uh, the top's got a little bit of damage to it. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's not not the worst upper deck's done, that's for dang sure. <laughs> Definitely not the worst. All right. Get him in a sleeve. There we go. So I think... One, two, three, four, five. So I think we're done with Young Guns, unless we get an extra because the French does not count. All right, so Slavin, Barry, Shattenkirk, Carrier, World Junior Grads, Maurice Cedar, class of 1920, 2020, class of 2020. Just not, I don't know, they're just kind of a meh card. Not, not a big fan, to be honest. Not a, not a fan of those at all. So we got five packs left. Can there be anything else hiding in here? Montour, Rantanen, Chikorin, and Brent Clark Superstar Honor Roll. Interesting. Still not a numbered one of those, but we're trying. All right, Brabinov, Trenin, Krebs, Matty Roy, and UD Canvas, Eric Lindros. Oh, this is one of those, uh, the short prints. Oh, yeah, baby. Yeah, or the legends. What do they call these? I'm trying to remember. They are... Huh. I have to, I'll have to see, but they're... Yeah, it's like the high series retired. So that would be one in 192 packs. Sweet. We'll take that. Pretty, pretty solid player, I would say. Yeah, that's a nice little hit. One in 192 packs. We'll take it. We will take it. All right, three packs left. Don't really know what could what is left to be hiding in here. Backland, Lawton, Mayo. They are. We do get an extra. Well, not an extra, but we do. Samuel Poulin. Lucky. I think he's supposed to be a decent young gun too. Not bad. So the French does not count, so nice. Okay. Couldn't remember. Um, you know, Upper Deck does some crazy stuff sometimes. I couldn't honestly couldn't remember if it did or not. So 
Not expecting a whole lot in the last two packs. So Panarin, Provorov, Shiri, Tavares. Welcome to Edmonton. Little postcardy look. Nice little, nice little hit here. And the last pack. Let's go. A little last pack mojo. Magic. Let's make it happen. Before I forget, um, thank you guys so much for all the support. We're, I think, at like 671 or two subscribers. So um, once we get to 700, we will be doing another giveaway. So make sure you hit the bell icon to be notified when we upload. And also, if you like the content, please consider subscribing because it does help the YouTube algorithm and keeps us front and center with uh, on the page. So on the front page. So Kimpe, Martinez. Boyd. Oh, Pink Dazzlers. Jake oh, Christensen. Yeah. Columbus. So maybe you get one of each. I don't remember. But hey, we'll take it. Not bad. Pretty decent box. We got uh, six, well, five young guns plus the plus the French and then the uh, the high series UD canvas. So not not terrible, honestly. Oh, and the highlighters too. So I mean that's our clear cut, so I'm pretty happy. This is it's not the best box in the world, but for our luck with series one and two, um, it this is pretty okay. Not going to complain. So thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, remember to like and subscribe, and we'll be having a lot more content coming out as the new stuff starts rolling in. So hope y'all have a great Easter weekend, and remember it's always good to be in the sin bin.